lecture we are going to discuss the question number 26 from NET GRF December 2018 and booklet code is A. So this is question from real analysis and basically question of a uniform continuity of a given function fx equal to 1 upon square root of x. So we have to identify whether this is a uniform continuous on this interval, on this interval or on this interval or only on this interval. So we know that if f is a function defined from a to r and an and pn are sequences defined on a such that or such that an minus bn tends to 0 for all an and bn define on a a n minus b n tends to 0 if this implies mod of f of a n minus f of b n tends to 0 then this always implies f is uniform continuous on a so this is necessary and sufficient condition for a function to be a uniform continuous on a <coughs> and another result is if f is a function Define on open interval a b to r which is continuous then f is a uniform continuous on open interval a b if and only if limit x tends to a plus right hand limit at a of f and limit x tends to a b b minus fx exist finitely. So if you have to, if a function is defined on open interval and it is continuous, then it must be uniform continuous if and only if limit at endpoints exist. So this is second property for uniform continuity. And similarly, <coughs> if a function is Defined from R to R, real line to real line, then F is which is continuous function, then F is a uniform continuous on R if limit mod of X tends to infinity Fx exists. So this condition is only sufficient condition and the last two conditions are necessary as well as sufficient. So we are going to use this all the three statements. So my function is fx is defined on 0 to infinity to r. So if we will take a sequence an which is 1 upon n square and bn which is 1 upon n plus 1 whole square these both sequences are defined on this domain and an minus bn tends to 0 and f of an minus f of bn mod of this tends to 1 so this implies this function is not a uniform continuous on any reason on which 0 is a limit point. So by using these two sequences we can easily identify this function is never uniform continuous on any reason in which 0 is a limit point. So hence first option since 0 is a limit point of this region so definitely this function is not uniform continuous on this. Similarly third option 0 is a limit point of this interval. So again this is not uniform continuous on this interval. So now we have to identify whether this is uniform continuous on this interval or not. So let's again so if we will define the function square root of x which is defined from r to infinity to r clearly this function is continuous and limit x tends to r plus fx exists finitely and all 
also limit x tends to infinity fx is 0 which is exist finitely so function is continuous and limit if this r exists and limit at infinity exists which is finitely implies this function is a uniform continuous on this region provided r is greater than 0 otherwise this limit does not exist hence this function must be uniform continuous on this region and in this option this only on this interval we can take a larger interval on which this is uniform so in this fourth option they are using only word so definitely fourth option is again false option